Hey guys and welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be attempting a Halloween makeup tutorial. It's probably not going to go so well because I'm not like a makeup expert. Okay, I don't even know what I'm going to do first. Before starting I applied my regular foundation. I decided to get some dark eyeshadow and put a line down my cheekbone diagonally towards my mouth. Um, I didn't end up liking the angle I had it, so I wiped it off. I got some more like eyeshadow and then gently patted it up my cheekbone in a more flat angle than the previous look. Um, I thickened the line up to make it stand out more and then I started to apply the same kind of cheekbone line on the other side of my face and I also thickened that line up so it was more defined and I just patched it up so it was darker now I'm applying some bronzer just around my face to kind of highlight some areas I'm starting with the nose so I got a small paintbrush because I don't really got a proper makeup brush and I got some black eyeshadow and just painted the base of my nose and there's me being a cat because I thought it looked like a cat. <laughs> so as I applied I just made sure I went over the lines to make it appear darker because I don't want it to look patchy. So I just went around and tied up all the little gaps. I had a little play around with the shape of the nose as well because I wasn't entirely sure how to do like a skeleton type nose. And then I got some white eyeshadow and just put it above my cheekbone and now I have got some black eyeshadow I'm just putting all over my lid. And then I kept building it up to my eyebrow and I then went back to darken it up so there was no patches and I just made sure I got everything on my lid. Now I went under my eye with some white eyeshadow and then kind of blended the black eyeshadow under my eye. I just kept building on the black eyeshadow to kind of make a circular blackness around my eyeball. <laughs> I kind of like a, a dog here, like a little Dalmatian or something. <laughs> then I just added some more darkness around and then I decided to move on to the other eye. And I basically just did the same thing. I just started with my eyelid and just built up towards my eyebrow, making sure that it's all the same darkness. Also applied some white eyeshadow directly under my eye and then builded the black eyeshadow underneath that so it is the same as the other eye. And I just went through and just patched up any bits I missed. Then I applied some mascara to my eyelashes, top and bottom, on both of my eyes if you can't see there. <laughs> Then I got a lip liner in a dark berry colour to match my headband and I just lined my lips with the pencil. And then I decided to fill my lips in with a pencil as well. I got a lipstick of the similar colour and then applied it on top of the liner. I decided I wanted a pop of colour and something that would also match the headband. Um, now I'm starting the little circles around my eyes so I got an eyeshadow that matches the lipstick. I'm not entirely sure what the eyeshadow is called. So I just put little spots around my eye and I tried to keep it symmetrical as possible. I decided not to go for a perfect circle. I just roughly got a paintbrush and then twisted it to make it look 
circular like. Now I just patched up any bits I had touching up to make them more darker and send out. And then I applied some more dark eyeshadow to my cheek and I just blended that out with a large brush so it wasn't as intense. So I just kept touching up my cheekbones because I didn't want it to look too light. And then I got my eyeliner and then I drew a line from my mouth to the corner of the cheekbone line and then I did the same with the other side making sure that the line was dark and could be seen then I put some vertical lines along the line that I just drew um, I put some grey and white eyeshadow up the center of my nose and the sides just to give it a little pop and the same with my cheeks just to make those areas stand out a bit. And I blended some more blending just to make sure the colours were all mixed together nicely. And then I got a gold colour and I decided to put some gold circles in between the berry coloured eyeshadow around my eyes just to add you know a third colour and some sparkle as well. So I just roughly did that in between each gap in the circle. And then I just went back just to make sure that there was no little patches. And I decided to put some gold around the outline of my lips just so it to match my eyes. And that the gold around my eyes was not totally random. And then I also added some gold on the line that I drew with the eyeliner. And then I decided to patch up my eyeshadow on my eyes and reapply some more mascara. And I put some bronzer on just to darken up some areas. And this look would work really well if you have some white face paint because it'll just make the colouring pop. So use that if you have it. I didn't have it so I didn't use any white face paint. And here is the finished look. Thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed today's video, if you did please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys very soon in another video. Bye!